The volume of this contaminated tank is three quarters water and one quarter air. A third of the water volume, which is three quarters of the total, is contaminated, and a fifth of the air volume is contaminated. So we can write the fraction of contamination as the following. Multiplying this out, the factors of three cancel on the left, we get 1 20th on the right. Putting both fractions in a common denominator of 20, we're then able to add. Then when we have six over 20, we can convert the denominator into 100 in order to get a percentage, and we get 30 over 100. If the setup isn't clear, you can clarify it or avoid it by considering the case in which the total volume is 60. 60 is often useful as an example when you have to do lots of dividing because it's divisible by so many small numbers. Then, in that case, 45 of the volume is water and 15 of that 45 is contaminated. Similarly, in that case, you'll find a volume of 3 for the air that's polluted for a total of 18 over 60, which is 6 over 20, and hence gives the same result as we have here. The correct answer is B.